Hello everybody. Uh, I'm starting a new uh, tutorial series, and uh, I call it Bootcamp Reverse Engineering. In this series, I will start uh, looking at uh, the default Bootcamp demo, and uh, let's see what the professional ones in Unity company done things and finding one by one different aspects of uh, Unity Bootcamp and uh, see how they done the job so that we can uh, find a proper way to do things and uh, to be honest Bootcamp demo is uh, very nice very intriguing and uh, I had built it uh, with uh, the default settings of Unity nothing's changed and it's here okay so let's take a look uh, but before starting I must say uh, for the sake of recording this video I uh, changed the graphic settings to the lowest uh, possible so that I can play it in uh, real time as much as, much as possible but sometimes I will change the quality to the fast uh, to the highest uh, and take a look around those times the video recording will be a little slow so bear with me for that now let's uh, resume it and take a look at the, the list that we have for uh, different aspects of unity and see what they had done in the project and how they had done it okay so the first thing you notice is uh, because my quality is very low uh, the textures on the floor is not correct <coughs> and the uh, playback is fast but some aspects are not quite well uh, shown so just uh, the first thing we want uh, to mention is that we have a pause menu and we can change the quality of game in pause menu for example okay and let's take a look at it okay so it's better so one thing we will take a look is uh, the pause menu and game settings the, setting, the second thing I want to mention is that uh, radar map in the top left corner it's a nice uh, mini map and I should call it radar uh, from now on the next thing we will take a look is that uh, in here if we move around I'm not hitting anything just forward button but take a look the soldier's leg is uh, bent and it's nice uh, placed on the uh, object and if I hit backward it's moving correctly so it's another thing we want to take a look and uh, well I just move around it faster I'm not sure if you can hear the sound correctly so we have an ambient sound there if you don't uh, hear the sounds correctly just open the bootcamp demo yourself and the plate and when you come to the bridge pay attention to your footsteps sounds I'll keep quiet but uh, after moving forward just Pay attention to the sound of uh, the footsteps. attention when you are moving on the bridge you 
can you uh, make the graphic quality a little bit down? Okay. When you are moving on the bridge, your footsteps are some uh, the differently. For example, here, <coughs> sorry, it will sound as you are walking on the wood. But uh, when I'm moving forward, the footstep sounds will change. If I'm free now, and again, it can uh, become wood. And after that, it will become a sound on the forest floor. Uh, it's one thing I wanted to mention. So we'll take a look at how they had done this. Another thing is, uh, most of the time players are uh, playing shooter games. They will play uh, first person shooters, but this uh, is a third person shooter demo. So we'll have a gun for third person with aiming point in the center of the screen, a zooming effect, and the first thing I want to sh uh, mention is that the zooming is uh, moving the camera to a new position, changing the uh, target point uh, color, and if you make uh, the quality as much as uh, possible high, oh come on, one more please, will you? Okay, it's the only setting that will show the difference. Now, I'll hit the right mouse key and keep it there, but take a look at the environment. Now I'm aiming the center tree, it will be focused, and in the background the train and the trees will be uh, blurred. Now I'm moving the mouse to the background it will be focused and the foreground will be large so the uh, depth of uh, field will be changed depending on your uh, position of aiming and this is something very interesting in uh, zooming effects for uh, the camera at uh, its fullest zoom as you can see I'm uh, aiming sky and everything is uh, large but as soon as I'm aiming the tree the tree will be focused and everything else will be blurred so this effect will be shown just in the top uh, quality but nothing else is in top quality so I'll drop it to the lowest and there's some again that was one of the things We'll definitely take a look at uh, for the top group changing. Now I'm moving forward to the uh, checkpoint of the game, and uh, where I should know that there is the checkpoint. If you take a look at the radar, there is a little uh, arrow in about 12 o'clock. It's uh, showing you the checkpoint. So I'm moving toward the checkpoint and you'll definitely see a nice uh, effect there. So another thing is that the bushes are... Okay, now it's another effect, the particle effect of moving the water. We'll take a look at that. And jump, jump. Oh, now, now if you look at the radar, We'll have a flashing point, that's our checkpoint. The radar system in the uh, demo is a little funny because when you are moving near the flash point, or I should say checkpoint, uh, the arrow is still there uh, and you don't need the arrow anymore because we can see the end point. So, 
the next thing I want to mention you here is the camera system it will calculate the occlusion as you can see but uh, the problem with this system is that it will penetrate the walls sometimes if I can show you more like here it's penetrating the wall and it's not perfect so and here is our endpoint uh, when I hit the checkpoint uh, an agent will come up and calls that uh, you finished the tutorial so we'll take a look at these systems uh, again so let me uh, put the list fast the first thing we want to look is the radar system the second thing is a uh, character locomotion the third is uh, our uh, zooming camera effect I should say the top wheel another thing, oh sorry it was 4 another thing will be our zooming camera movement the next thing will be our uh, different footstep sounds sounds the next thing will be our uh, uh, different checkpoint officer sorry and uh, we'll take uh, a look is how can we load to the next level the next thing will be a water effect particle The next thing will be our third person gun system. Next will be a camera occlusion system. Next will be our uh, boot camp environment uh, development. The next will be our pause menu. changing gain quality and I mentioned something in the playing time I don't remember now uh, I'll leave it blank for now so we'll take a look at all of these uh, until next tutorial